All right, guys, so here we have our cocktail components for tonight. Um, as Bruce mentioned before, we would love to do alcohol to go this year, but unfortunately, um, it's not quite passed yet as a loss. So we will um, hopefully be able to do some real booze-heavy cocktails in future boxes, as well as a bottle of wine. Um, if you are making the cocktail with alcohol tonight, I recommend, um, you can really do a number of spirits here. Vodka and gin are probably the two most common. Um, you could also do this with tequila if you wanted to, or if you want to get real crazy, you can do a, um, like a soju or um, some sort of Chinese rice liquor. Um, you don't have to go to those extremes. Vodka will do just fine. So we have a, uh, what I'm calling a Hong Kong crush, which is a base of lychee and yuzu that I did a little bit of lemon, um, some lychee simple syrup, and then we have the bottle of Saratoga in here that you can have mixed in with a cocktail and then also a glass of uh, you know, sparkling water with dinner tonight. Um, if you're pairing wine, you know, to me this is, this is really great with a lot of whites. Anything that is very fruit forward, a Gewürztraminer, or a Riesling, a uh, Pinot Gris. Later on in the menu, once we get into the duck and the pork dishes, um, something rich and deep and red. Um, is really nice, something like a, a, an earthy Pinot Noir or um, a fruit forward Gamay, something that isn't too tannic. Um, you know, I like a little bit of spice on some of these dishes, um, so something a little bit on the lighter side, but still earthy is, is kind of fun. Um, so to make the cocktail tonight, I went ahead and, went ahead and put um, an ounce and a half of vodka in my glass here with ice. I'm then gonna take a little bit of the seltzer, I do a, a base of sparkling water just to help mix. And then I'm going to go right in with my cocktail base, enough to probably make two cocktails, and then just give it a little top. And uh, you can do this with a spoon or anything you have. I'm using some fresh bamboo, and just give it a quick stir, and you're good to go. Cheers.